All right, welcome to video log uh, episode number two. We're down at Nullawarri in Victoria, which is about five and a half hours from home. Um, <clears throat> staying at Lauren and Gavin White's place. Um, and we're racing at Mount Gambier tonight, which is about another hour and a half down the road. Um, and then we're racing at Warnable tomorrow night, which is only you know, 15 minutes down the road here from Nullawarri. Um, so, Gavin and Lauren were nice enough to, to have me and, and Levi and Rachel um, to stay here for the weekend. Uh, fantastic people and um, it's always great to stay at their place. They're very welcoming and um, always have great hospitality. So um, pretty soon we'll head, out, head down to Mount Gambia for tonight's round and uh, we've got to stop on the way and pick up a new race suit. So we're here at Mount Gambia, just unloaded the car and it's just started drizzling rain, but I don't think there's much in it. Boys are just getting tarp out, put over it, getting some tyres and, and wheels sorted out. Just getting unpacked. Did pick up the brand new race suit. Righto, just want to give uh, Safety Mike from Performance Race Gear a shout out for this awesome new P1 suit um, that we were lucky enough to win in a competition that he ran on Facebook. Thanks, thanks to you, Mike, from Performance Race Gear, and uh, um, yeah, ho hopefully we can put it on the podium. Heat one, we're starting off pole position. Um, there's like 12 cars in a heat, 10 laps of heat. So hopefully we can get the win off pole, and then the second heat we're starting off last. So it says nearly 60 cars here, so. Um, can't afford to lose the first heat really and um, yeah we have to get after it in the second heat and see how many cars we can pass. Right, so we just got done with our first heat and unfortunately we ran second. Um, got drag raced off the start and um, yeah fell into second place into the first corner and then threw everything I had um, to try and get the lead back. Just absolutely tried high tried low tried everything we we're right there all over the back of him but couldn't make the pass so um unfortunately we finished second which is gonna hurt us a little bit we really needed to win that um so we're starting off at a tenth in the next heat and we need to really move forward into the top three um to put us up the front of the a main so we'll, we'll see what we can do and go from there
was supposed to start out in position 10 and two cars didn't make it out on the track that was supposed to start in front of us. So we started in position six and um, got to second and the leader was gone, checked out. So we had to settle for second, but um, that's picked our night back up. We're all, we should be somewhere in the top six of the AMA now and uh, that'll give us a good crack at winning. Um, got the car owner here, Harry beside me and Harry, well, I mean, what's your thoughts after the heats, um, you know, with the car and, and looking forward onto the, the feature? Yeah, pretty happy with the speed that the car had. Um, we're all over the guy in front of us in the first heat and we set the quickest time in the second heat. I think that's one of the quickest times in the nine. So, the car speed's there, that's good. The track's changing, the track's going away a little bit, so you have to chase it, but that's okay. Um, sort of, it's what we expected for, for Mountain this time of year. So, um, yeah, we'll make a few changes and tie yep. snug her up a bit for the finals and see how we roll. Yeah, I think we're looking at maybe, we've done a few calculations and I think we might be starting out of a round of fifth. Fifth or sixth. Maybe fifth or sixth in the A main. Just try and work the points out ourselves. Unfortunately, we're back in the trailer early because uh, we got rained out three laps into the A main. So um, we we're doing really well. We started fifth um, in the few laps we got done, which was like three or four laps. We made it up to third, sitting comfortably in third. And then, um, yeah, then it started drizzling rain. Then there was a crash back in the pack. So brought the yellows out, slowed everyone down, and then the rain just kept coming, and uh, it was just too much. Turned the track into an ice skating ring, basically, and they had to cancel the race with um, like 22 laps to go, which means that it's a non-event, so no points, no money, no nothing. Um, you have to race at least half the distance. So disappointing end of the night. We had um, the fastest lap in the heats, out of all the heats and all the cars, we had the fastest lap time, so um, definitely had car speed and shame we couldn't um, race it out to the end and yeah, said we couldn't put it on the podium again. But uh, as they say, that's racing and we're in the trailer, heading home early and I will try again tomorrow night.